This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello, I'm Peter Dowd. Here's what's happening around Southern California. People could see a lot of smoke over Griffith Park today. A small brush fire broke out west of the 5 Freeway. About a quarter of an acre burned. No buildings or homes were threatened. Hundreds of people rallied in El Cajon demanding the resignation of the police chief days after an unarmed black man was shot and killed by an officer. The father of Alfred Olongo told the crowd his son's death is a turning point in the struggle to change police practices. Other speakers called for changes to how officers responded to people with mental issues. Police are now looking for one of two drivers who hit and killed a man in LA's Harvard Heights neighborhood. Police say the man was in an unmarked crosswalk when he was hit by two cars. One of the drivers took off. The other stayed and spoke with police. Police have not released a description of the car. Steer clear of the 710 in East LA this week. The northbound lanes between the 5 and 60 freeways are closed until Monday morning. Crews are repaving the freeway. Expect to see the same closure for seven more weekends. For the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, stay with CBSLA.com. Now here's Amber Lee with a look at the weather. Hey Amber. Hi Peter. So we're expecting some gusty winds, especially for the mountains and high desert communities as a low pressure system starts to dig a little bit closer to us here in Southern California. So that means cool and breezy with below average temperatures expected as we head into Sunday. Mid 70s for LA and Orange County Metro, low 70s for the coast tomorrow and 81 for inland valleys before things warm up by the end of the week. All right, Amber, thanks. And that's your CBSLA.com news brief. Remember, we're always on. Click listen live on our webpage to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations live anywhere you are.